Hello everyone, I am back again with an ATC card. Um, this one is made by using 10 uh, randomly drawn cards from my mixed media uh, prompt cards. Um, got a whole stack of them and uh, these, I think about 60, only have um, um, prompts and techniques in them. So I really like that. My boyfriend drew 10 of them. Um, I'm starting out with um, the first card that said uh, use a medium of your choice to create a texture. So I chose modeling paste through a stencil. The second one said choose a color and then pick three mediums, um, different mediums and use them. So I chose ink as you can see and gelatos and acrylic paints in the color of green because I don't use green that much so I thought I might challenge myself a bit more and um, starting to like how it's going to look but still don't know how many cards and which cards that I am going to have to use so this one said I think it's the third one I uh, use black and white spatter on your um, project. So I'm choosing uh, this black ink and I'm choosing gesso that's watered down. Really like the way that looks. And it's an easy technique to do. Now, the um, next one said, oh it's a free card to use a one medium for one thing you can do. So I chose to take out the modeling paste again through another stencil. Um, because I well, thought I liked it. I <laughs> don't know why. I just dried it a little bit, but not that much. Um, then the card said, use a background stamp and stamp it on your project. So that's what I'm doing. Just choosing the color green that I used on the card in the beginning. And then I'm stamping also into the wet modeling paste. Um, and it gives a nice, nice texture, even more texture than there was already there. Cleaning up quite well, so I can use it again later. Um, then the card said, um, pick a scrap of paper and uh, tear out a heart and glue it down. So that's what I'm doing. Got this, well, it's kind of a thick paper, but I, I really like the pattern and I think the colors match as well. So just tearing out a, a heart and gluing it down. That's basically it. It's that easy. So I'm just using gel medium because I find that it glues better on a textured surface instead of a glue stick. I said that in the last video I did as well. Um, then I, um, I skipped this one. It said use Vaseline and I didn't have any Vaseline lying around. So I chose another one. I drew a random another one and it said use thread or uh, fabric. So I'm using embroidery thread and I'm gluing it down with gel medium because I didn't know what was going to go next. So that's why uh, I'm just gluing it down. Um, this one said, uh, use a pencil, close your eyes and doodle on your projects. It's a bit difficult, but I'm managing. I use a charcoal pencil in this case. Um, and then uh, the card said, use one of the cards that you have already chosen and do that, um, uh, well, do the technique again. So I chose the black and white spatter. Um, then the next one said, I think it said doodle something, but I skipped that one as well. Uh, because just, just, just creative freedom. So I, drew, <laughs> I took another one. Uh, sometimes you have to be creative in doing things that you like and, uh, not doing the things that you don't like. So, um, choosing another one and it said, um, use, do something with letters. So I thought I need a sentence anyway. So I'm just stamping a sentence and I wanted to write down, I like Messi, but it sounded like I like the football player Messi. Um, so I'm just changing it in. I like a mess because I do. I like a mess. And then I think I'm almost done already. So this was, I think this was the last card that I drew. So um, I'm going around with my black ink because I like that. And I'm going around with my black uh, gel pen. And um, 
I'm just backing up the card uh, because the thread was going around the back as well and didn't want to wanted to show that so this is it black line as I said before and another project is done so in real time this was 42 minutes um, I'm gonna say bye everyone until next time bye bye and I'll see you later